What's going on, Rolling Out TV? You're now tuned into another blazing hot episode of You've Been Frightened. On today's show, we head over to Shade 45 to catch up with Angela Yee to find out exactly what goes on in the studio off the air. I intended to do marketing here. I got an interview um, thanks to Paul Rosenberg, Eminem's manager, and they offered me an opportunity to do the morning show with Cypher Sounds. They told me if I was whack, that was it for me. It was an audition, probationary period of not getting paid for like, you know, a month or something. And then um, we had a couple good interviews, one in particular with Jay-Z, and they decided to keep me. We had Murs on the show, and that was a really fun interview because he got crazy and, you know, with some porn stars and did some things that I couldn't believe he did. Um, I think sometimes we have interviews and we're like, wow, did that just happen? And maybe when we did the Young Berg interview, when it happened, it wasn't so crazy where he talked about, you know, how he doesn't like dark sex, but the after effect from that, you know, turned out to be really crazy. Um, I'm trying to think who else has been. I mean, there's been times when I've talked to people and they've opened up a lot. And like Sierra, I interviewed Sierra and people were like, oh, she doesn't talk about anything. You know, she's very well trained. But then I interviewed her and I thought she was really cool and very open about, you know, talking about a lot of things that I never heard her say before. I think that if you are going to come in and do an interview with me, yes, you should be a little bit nervous because we don't know what I know or what I might ask, you know. Gorilla Zoe came on and he talked about how um, he was in Europe, you know, popping e-pills and having orgies with mad women, you know, like <laughs> out of nowhere. I would like to get certain people on lip service. Like, I've had a lot of people on my morning show, but I would like to get them on my nighttime show. Like, I would love to have 50 on lip service. I think he would be really funny. And Diddy as well, because he's having tantric sex for two days, you know. And that would be a good place for him to discuss something like that. I'm trying to think what other... I know there has to be some people that I haven't spoken to yet that I would love to think about that. Later on, put down my wish list. Uh, obviously Prince, because he's my favorite. 